Hey, I'm Not So Waste Trainer, and welcome to another quick guide. In this one, we're going to be taking a look at how you shiny hunt in the Grand Underground. In order to shiny hunt in the Grand Underground, I recommend you enter it in online mode and not playing alone, since it can be really time consuming. Either way, as soon as you get underground, start looking for some Diglett and Duke Drio. Diglett will give you one light stone and Duke Drew will give you three light stone. They spawn in the corners or the intersections, so focus on those as much as possible. After collecting a few, or if you can't see any, enter and exit your secret base or a Pokemon hideaway in order for them to reset. After you get the 40 light stone, the shiny odds double for 4 minutes if you're playing alone or 5 minutes if you're online. This will be marked by a loud whistle and after that you have to rush to the closest Pokemon hideaway. Since shinies do not show on the overworld, you have to encounter every Pokemon in order to shiny check. After you're done with that specific Pokemon hideaway, just exit and enter again to reset the spawns. After 4 or 5 minutes depending on how you are playing, you get the whistle again and you're back on the Diglett slash Dugtrio hunt. Now here are some tips to help you through the hunt. As soon as you see the number of lightstone close to 40, start hunting for Diglett close to a hideaway. And also, get your hands on a Pokemon with a runaway ability, like Ponyta for example, so you don't waste any time when trying to escape a battle. And that is how you shiny hunt in the Grand Underground and the Pokemon Hideaways. Honestly, I do not recommend it, but it is in the game, so here's a guide for it. Thank you so much for watching, consider subscribing for more Pokemon content, and I'll see you all on the next one.